Nike is just like being thrown to the wolves. When they see you missing confidence or not appearing to enjoy it, they're, they're gone. It takes seconds. It's, it's terrifying. You just, mm. And then you're, then you're just fighting, like climbing uphill, trying to get them back. Um, and you don't want to, you don't want to be on the ropes. I mean, you all will be on the ropes if you continue at some point. We all, we all die and we all have shockers, but they're the ones you learn from the most. So yeah, anything when you just absolutely kill it, you don't. I've, I've, I've been on stages, 13,000 people, 15,000 Wembley arena, Stockholm globe, you know, some of the biggest venues in the world and killed it and learned nothing really just came away thinking well i'm a god essentially of comedy <laughs> that's that's the conclude that's the logical conclusion that's about it to go and have a few beers but then the next time you get on stage and you die it's often linked to feet like that swagger like feeling that you were some kind of god you come on you're overconfident you die have you ever died a hundred times yeah of course really do it without dying it's impossible. There's literally not a comedian on earth who hasn't had multiple deaths. No one. And the very best comedian, whoever your favourite comedian is in the whole world, sorry, I just got to let the dog out. If you're serious, you've got to go, I'm all in. I'm all in. Yeah. You know yeah. how broke I was? I, I, I quit my job to, to try it, and I was taking gigs that were like £20. But I got a drive to like Staffordshire. That's like forty-five pounds petrol. And then what? I'm going to drive straight back. I'm going to have to, or get a B and B for like eighty pounds. You know, that was my first year. That's most people's first year. So yeah, like it's 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 not it's not going to be easy. But it's like the, it's about the levels of determination. So it's one of them things I just say, like, you don't, don't go into it lightly because it, it, it asks a lot of you. Well, my first question, yeah, the timing's all off now, okay, but it was who let the dogs out because Ben went up to let the dog. Anyway, um, <laughs> <laughs> I was going to say, what, what do you yeah, think? That, that timing is off, that's off by that about time. 17 minutes. <laughs> Wow, you know what I mean? At this point, what even is time? Um, <laughs> so I just, I just want your opinion. Obviously, I don't know that anyone in the world is an expert on this, but what do you think about a world class, and by world class, I mean comedian that makes it in America, um, British or particularly black British comedian that is trying to do that? Do you think it's feasible? Do you think there'll ever be a um, yeah, it's already, Trevor it's already Noah or Stephen, what's his name? The guy that does the daily show, the, the yeah, yeah, I yeah, yeah. It's, it's, it's already happening. I was, I was, I was actually with Trevor Noah the the day he got that news. Bizarrely, okay. yeah, we were both we were rehearsing together for Comic Relief, and I was so happy for him because I, you know, I'd worked with him a few times just on the circuit and and whatnot, and that that was a time I thought, yeah, it's totally possible. Like when I came in the game, there was John Stewart. Yeah, uh, that's the one. That's and, the one. and you know, he 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 was on the circuit with us, and he 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 went over. Um, listen, funny's funny, man. Like a, 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 um, flipping Steve Merchant, I worked with loads. Like he he went over, did his thing. I just think funny. If you're funny, it just tr it translates, man. It really does. Mm -hmm. uh, and and like also Jeannie Yashiri, when when I was starting out, she was going over. And doing the black circuit there and killing it. And now London Hughes, who I, again I've worked with hundreds of times, she's she's just solidified herself in LA, you know, doing comedy. So yeah, I I don't think funny has a postcode anymore. Mm -hmm.